So let's say you have a, a Lexar SD card that's corrupt. So you go to Lexar.com and you download the, the Fix-It software for Lexar. So you can search, you know, SD card recovery, um, and you download. You know, you go to Lexar. Lexar.com support downloads, and then you can, you know, SSDs. Download the recovery tool for your OS, Mac, or Windows, and then. Um, Here's the manual on how to do it and download that. But I don't even think you really need to have a manual. I don't know, they just had somebody write one, I guess. But, um, huh. Let me see SSD memory cards. Download it. It's downloaded. You run it. It's basically a compressed file. So it needs admin rights. It'll ask for the admin password. And then it'll fire up and run. So the computer can't see my SD card. That's how bad it is. So I'm going to click on, you choose which one it is. And it's a 64 gig RAM drive. Failed to detect the capacity. And then make a folder of where you want everything. To... I'm doing this a second time because the the files that it recovered are all kind of splotchy, They're all full of holes. I mean, um, which means like there's only half an image. And then the MP4s that play from the movies I recorded, uh, like Star 64. I'll name this directory. You make a directory of where you want it. And then you go next. And this takes literally, it takes all day long. And I'm just going to say, just recover all items. Next. On 64 gigs, this is a pretty fast machine. It, it, this thing literally takes all day. So it'll run, it'll find, you select the ones you want, or just say select all, and then just say recover. And be prepared to let it sit for about six hours to get it done.